welcome to all. Today I am here to deliver a speech about Quit India Movement. Quit India Day has huge historical significance for India. It reminds us of the great mass movement organized under the leadership of Mahatma Gandhi. This day is a proud occasion for us. It was on 8th August 1942 that India demanded complete freedom from the British rule. It was endorsed after talks between the Congress and the British had failed as Indians were forced to participate in the Second World War. Indians urged to act as an independent nation and not to follow the orders of the British. There was a mass protest demanding what Gandhi ji called an orderly British withdrawal from India. On 8th August at Gwalior Tang Maidan in Mumbai, Gandhi ji issued a call to do or die. He advised for the Hindu Muslim unity. Kitania Day makes us feel proud to be a part of nation that never surrendered to the oppressions of the colonial rule. Thank you. like to say a few lines on the topic Quit India Movement, a highly significant day in the month of August which holds a special place in Indian history is August 9th. On this day, the Quit India Movement or the August Movement is celebrated. In this year, we are celebrating 79th anniversary of Quit India Movement. It was started in a speech in Bombay where Mahatma Gandhi asked the people to do or die. It was civil disobedience movement on 8th of August 1942. During the Second World War asking for an end to British rule in India. The next day on 9th of August 1942, Mahatma Gandhi and many other leaders were arrested by British government the first half of the Quit India movement was peaceful till the release of Mahatma Gandhi and the second half was violent. Dr. K. B. Menon was lead the Quit India movement in Kerala. The day is celebrated by paying tribute to freedom fighters. Thank you. to talk a few words about Good India Movement. The Good India Movement, also known as August Movement, was a movement started by Mahatma Gandhi on 8 August 1942 during the Second World War asking for an end to British rule in India. The movement was started in a speech in Bombay where Mahatma Gandhi asked Indians to do or die. The Congress launched a protest asking the British to withdraw from India. However, the British imprisoned most of the Congress leadership such as Gandhi ji, Jawaharlal Nehru, Abdul Kalam Azad and Dr. Rajendra Prasad. 
The arrest of Gandhiji and the Congress leaders led to mass demonstration throughout India. Thousands were killed and injured in the second half. The British refused to grant immediate independence until the Second World War ended. The Quit India movement more than anything united the Indian people against British rules. Finally, India gained independence on 1947. Thank you.